hundred feet. Yeah, we're coming up towards five hundred feet now. Yeah, we're going up to two thousand. Right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, one of the things that's really important when we fly is to keep a lookout for other gliders and aircraft. Yeah. So what we do is we actually scan the whole field of view to the left and the right. And when you release the um, the the um, toe, do do we drop it slightly? No, the opposite. In fact, what will happen no, is right. there will be a clump when the road goes, Not and then I'll raise the nose of the glider up, do a climbing turn to the left. Right. And what the tug will do is he'll dive to the right. Right. And the idea of that being that we put a little bit of distance between us. Yeah. Yep. So if we were to both dive in the same direction, there could be conflict. Well, yes. <laughs> so when there's this rule that I climb to the left, and the reason I can climb is because of my airspeed is quite high, so I can climb right. using that airspeed, yep? Yep. So you're on 600 knots? No, six, uh, yeah. six, 60 knots. 60 knots, yeah. So what's the stalling speed? Uh, about 35 knots. Right. So, you know, I'm not going to fly it below 40. Uh, no. Most of the time around 45. I seem to remember on a, a winch tow, you yeah. drop slightly when they drop the winch. That's so. right, yeah. You relax the pressure on the cable. Uh, if you don't do that, what happens is the cable itself can be um, fly down towards the winch and cause the winch to, uh, uh, the drum of the winch to have a problem. Right. And you don't get a very happy winch driver. No. So we're coming up... We're coming up with 1900 now, yeah? Right, yep. Yeah. And when we get to 2000, yep. I'm going to release us, and we're coming up towards that now, yeah? Yep. Because he, he obviously knows when you come to 2000. So we're at 2000 now, so I'm going to release, and then I'm going to raise the nose, and up to the right. To the left, sorry. Yeah. Don't know my left or right. And he's dived the other way. Yeah. He just yeah. feels you come off the winch and then... Yeah, he knew, he knew what height we were at. Right. So he was... Uh, now what I'm going to do now, if you'd like to take the controls with your right hand now. I have it. If I take control again, will you? Yeah, you have it. Now if I can't get any lift, at some point I'm going to have to go in land because I just can't... Yeah, don't worry. You will know where the airfield is. Yeah, just go <laughs> to the left. There's, there's a nice story of a chap in the first... He took it first to... Yeah, you lose your airfield and he, he landed in a field and the um, sergeant came across and what the hell are you doing? <laughs> he lost the airfield and it was next door. Very easy to do. Yeah. yeah. 